thank you for your time and welcome to afghan.com and for giving your precious time for us so to start with i'd like also to to thank you for taking the time to to meet with us and uh, for sure you know we always appreciate our calm and we appreciate the information that they, that they provide it's very helpful very technical uh, as any other plant other any industrial uh, plant uh, it, it also get impacted by uh, certain equipment failures and um, the latest uh, failure we had with our uh, cold box as we have announced if you look at the technical uh, uh, I would say uh, information about the cold box it is a box that you don't see much out of it except monitoring of the LEL uh, and also visual inspection of the exterior uh, and what I call is um, also uh, 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 I would say it's unfortunate it happened, but also I, I, co I, I consider it something fortunate that we caught it before it went very bad. Uh, so we have discovered an issue with the cold box that has been leaking outside, and alhamdulillah we took the right action. You know, some other companies, uh, if you look at the history of the cold box, uh, if uh, it was, was not monitored right, it went to a really big disaster. Uh, companies that uh, had explosion, it lost six months, some even uh, lost uh, nine months of operation. Uh, Alwaha, we managed to, to cut it before it goes to that level. Uh, we started the shutdown, in, uh, as we announced, on September 9th, and uh, we have even called uh, the vendor, supplied the chart, and they are here, and they uh, are monitoring the progress of uh, the, fi the fixes that is required. Uh, I, uh, understood that today we uh, have gone inside and uh, we have uh, noticed a certain um, failure of uh, 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 some of the equipment inside it and we expect that this will be fixed and will operate into the level that uh, was always uh, operating uh, by. Uh, when I look at the shutdown, I looked also the reaction that was taken. And you know, yes, it is unfortunate, but also it tells a lot about the organization itself when it handle uh, the unfortunate uh, incident. Uh, what what do they do? Do they just uh, uh, do the normal or they do the abnormal? What happened in Al after we discovered the shutdown and we knew that there will be a turnaround in 19, we worked very hard to really ensure that to propone uh, the shutdown of 19 to uh, 18. And we have managed to, really to secure the services, the material, the contractors, uh, allowing 900 people to get into the plant to, to work. And I call that a success. And that tells how energy has been put to really to ensure that uh, I know it, it is unfortunate, but also how to make sure this unfortunate minimize and transform it to something that are uh, uh, for the better of, of the 2019. When do you think that the, the defect will be fixed? Well, we are working on it, you know, as we announced, uh, it will take us 30 days. So we expect uh, early uh, first week of uh, December that we will start uh, operate, I mean, uh, starting up. Uh, and uh, again, as I said, with all the work that has been done, we expect uh, 2019 uh, to be a year of uh, rectifying uh, the matters uh, in Al-Waha and uh, ensuring that we will be able to, to meet uh, or higher than the business plan that was put for 2018. You know, we, uh, as I said, it's also, uh, I will not call it, I would say, uh, it's unfortunate for sure, but uh, if you look at uh, the polypropylene uh, prices, uh, these days was is not good. Uh, uh, fourth quarter uh, did uh, not to the level where we are expecting. So uh, by avoiding uh, the, the, I would say the low prices of polypropylene this quarter, and we expect 19 uh, to be a better. Uh, so this delta of uh, low prices in uh, first quarter 18 and better prices in uh, second quarter of uh, 19 and first quarter and 19 and, and the rest of 19 we expect good price. You know, we feel that you know all this balance 
of uh, the losses we had in 18 will be rectified or will be managed by, by a better performance in 2019. Okay. You know, we, uh, in, in March, we announced that we are reassuming uh, the merge. But for sure, a, a company like ours and a company like uh, Sibcam will require lots of documentation, lots of work to prepare for a successful merge. Uh, we see the merge uh, added value to both two companies that are successful. When we merge and we transform to a bigger company, that will ensure that will make us better, strong, and in, in, in both in, in the product that we're going to be making, and also financially, as well as it will give opportunity to our staff, our uh, employees, uh, to re to really have a better growth in a bigger company. Uh, now, what are we are doing? We are reviewing all the documentation that is required for uh, merge. You know, we uh, we are doing the due diligence uh, for the technical, fi finance, uh, legal, and uh, we are progressing well. Uh, we will have to review it with our board, and we are planning to do that. Uh, then we will have to submit to uh, CMA for review of their review, and then will go to the General Assembly. So that, as, as we planned or as we forecast in, in, uh, in the MOU, that we expect the first quarter of uh, 19, uh, probably in, in February, that we'll be able to reach uh, the conclusion. As you know, uh, the MOU that we signed is non-binding, and we are trying to work everything so to make it uh, binding uh, and uh, get approved by all the authority as well as our uh, both boards. Hopefully, inshallah, by February. Well, this is what we, we forecast. You know, we are working very hard to, to, to teach, to, I mean, to meet that uh, target. And we are seeing it uh, to our expectation workable. Which will come out after the merger of two big giants. Mm -hmm. uh, what will be the future expansion plan of this? You know, uh, as, as uh, we also believe and Sipkim, a company that does not grow does not sustain. And uh, we are trying to, you know, we uh, definitely we are, as Sahara, we have, we are working on a certain, um, I would say, growth for Sahara. Sifkim is doing the same. Uh, when we really merge, we will have to review all those plans. And we expect that uh, we'll, we'll achieve a growth that is expected for a bigger company. We will have the potential of uh, uh, the, the financial as well as we will have the people that will be able to, to run uh, the new the new entity we are tra we are working on uh, uh, what we have is a merge of equal that means both company will treat the merge in an, in an equal basis thank you thank you so much for thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.